create a web application using Django like this I can create new project then in which I am the Python project only I have given in which I have selected new environment or I can have previously configured interpreter I am selecting previously configured interpreter so click on that create then this is only the platform which is called environment the environment we have to create the site and then within that site we are going to create web application so click the terminal python project we have this is the same python project we are in that select uh, we have to install PAP install the Django if it is not there in your system you can already have it so I am not trying this now you can have the Django admin admin start project click on that start project uh, DJM start project giving uh, site okay I am creating this site first site site 1 okay site 1 click on that you will be getting this look at there the site 1 has been created okay D Django admin start project site 1 then move on to that site 1 ok you can find the two this is the folder and this is the manage.py file ok so site 1 within this python project it's a environment where i have created site 1 this is the common folder ok main folder within that this is actual folder which is called root within the root you can find this five files ok so in the root folder only we are going to create uh, look at there cd uh, site 1 so in that only i am creating in this file look at there uh, python project the site 1 i have within the site 1 okay look at this file site 1 already have created site within the site we have to include web application this is only our actual web application where we are going to include all the codings that is request for the server and it is providing a response okay this code will be included in the web application okay all uh, this is the actual page will be shown okay so we have to enter into the site that's what i have given this code start app then first app I am creating look at there the first app automatically created here this is our actual uh, environment in which site 1 within the site 1 I have created first app ok the first app which is having the 6 files in which we are going to work with the views Okay, the view is collections of methods which are associated with the, the particular web application what we are going to develop click on this file the code we have to remember uh, from django automatically this file has been imported this statement is also there from django.shortcuts we import render like that we import another file which is uh, from the Django dot HTTP import 
HTTP response. Okay, then create a method. This method is built in, it is available. You have to make this as a request and you can return the response, HTTP response with the, this is a message. Okay, right. So anything wrong or any statements are missing in the sense it will show this kind of message just click on that and reformat the file okay automatically it is structured properly save this file then we have to open uh, url file the url file actually not there in our first app web application so right click on it new python file so give the name as urls then the urls dot py file will be opened so we have to uh, include the statement the Django dot urls import path okay from this file we have to include the path import the path then from dot import use okay now the url pattern that we have to specify url patterns it's a list where we are going to give the path detail use dot index name index ok and don't forget to include comma it's a end, ending statement ending note ok ok unwanted spaces or anything will be available in this sense that will be removed automatically so this is urls dot py file we have created Please remember this is about my that is our application web application details that we have completed. Then this web application path should be set with site. Okay, the site we have this is root folder. Okay, the root folder select urls.py file, click this import. Okay, already two files are imported. In words, the second one include this one include okay then same url patterns we have to add one more which is path uh, what is the file we have created first tab first tab this is the path we have to specify okay then uh, give include method in which uh, first app dot urls dot urls okay select this one and uh, don't forget to include comma there okay this is also correct then this ways we have given correctly two path we have given first app slash we have to include first app dot urls okay right now go to run you are going to configure the file okay select this plus and python named it as bjango we can use this the same script path we are setting the script path for execution so this is our project in which select the root site 1 in which we have manage.py manage.py file will be the interface okay then run server apply okay right then run this file manage.py I have selected now I am able to click on run Django file run So it is open click on this url click on that now we have to select 
first app. Okay, I hope you are able to see this. Hi, welcome to Django first application. So this is the message we have given that is loaded on our web browser. Okay, where I have given the first app, select this views, I have given this message. Okay. Server connected, just I have given this. Right, it has been shown properly. Then I need to include some more statement here. The same index I'd like to include. Uh, just uh, I would like to write that's equal to just a list I'm creating. Are in range of this ten I have given the x dot append of i okay return http response I would like to include a HTML tag H1 so it will be displayed like this elements or it will be shown like this okay in a bold style okay then colon values are that is list of values correct list of values here I want to get that so formatted statement I am giving Close it dot one line at just I can remove this. Okay, this is HTML code will be displayed in H1 tag followed by this list of values, and here the value will be shown. So put dot then format of x so this is the actual file is shown okay a list list detail will be shown okay. save this file again i am running this click on this select first tab List object has no attribute append. Oh, wrongly I have given app ent. Correct. First app. Okay. This the value has been shown correctly. That's all about this.